Hello. How are you? Today, you are going to study English 7, lesson number 8, third quarter. Types of assertion. React to what is asserted or expressed in a text. After going through this video lesson, you are expected to define each types of assertion. Familiarize with the types of assertion and its expressions. And boost your environmental awareness through the presented articles. For a start, do the following exercise. You can pause this video if you need more time. Press play again if you want to proceed with the lesson. Oops! Before you pause and play, don't forget to get a paper and a pen. Are you holding a paper and a pen now? That's great. You may start answering the pretest now. Let's reveal the answer now in the pre-test. In the previous lesson, you have learned to cite evidence to support a general statement. Today, you are going to react to what is asserted or expressed in a text. Get yourself ready to focus. Yawn and shrug your shoulders. Let's look at the picture and read the article presented. Arosaros Forest Park is located in Manila. The park became the subject of controversy in 2003 when Mayor Nito Atienza ordered its closure to give way to the construction of a school administration building and teacher's dormitory on a portion of the park despite protest from the conservation groups this was the statement of chiki c kiemabanta the president of winner foundation a private environmental group there is a law that mandates cities and municipalities to exert best efforts to preserve permanent forest three parks and watersheds Mabanta said. Questions. What was the controversy about the park? What do you think was the reaction of Chiki C. Kiyamabanta and the citizens of Manila? There was a controversy before about Arroceros Forest Park that was supposed to be turned into a gymnasium and school faculty that criticized from the president of Winner Foundation, a private environment group. The Manileños were disappointed about it because Arroceros is a part of the history of Manila. Let's begin with our discussion. What is assertion? An assertion is a statement used to make a declaration or to express strong belief on a particular topic. Three types of assertion. Number one, basic assertion. It is a simple and straightforward statement for expressing feelings, opinions, and beliefs such as, I wish I could have expressed this idea earlier because now someone else had taken the credit. Excuse me, first I want to finish my work. Then I shall go with you. Let's move on to number two. Emphatic assertion. It conveys sympathy to someone and usually has two parts. The first is to recognize the feelings or situations of the other person. And the second is a statement that shows support for the other person's viewpoints, feelings, or rights, such as. 
I understand you are busy, and me too, but it is difficult for me to finish this project on my own. So, I want you to help me complete this project. I know this is making you angry and frustrated because you have not gotten a response yet, but I can help you by giving you an estimate of how long it might take. Number 3. Escalating Assertion It occurs when someone is not able to give a response to a person, and therefore that person becomes firm about him or her such as. I really want to finish this point before you start yours. If you do not finish this work by 6 o'clock tonight, I will engage the services of another worker. The last one, language assertion. It is useful for expressing negative feelings. Nevertheless, it constructively lays emphasis on a person's feelings of anger, such as. When you speak harshly, I cannot work with you because I feel annoyed. Therefore, I want you to speak nicely and then assign me a task. When I don't get enough sleep, it affects my nerves and I feel irritated. Therefore, I try to go to bed earlier. Let's have an example here. Let's read the article. We will find out the type of assertion and the reaction of the reader about the article. Let's read the statement of a reader about this article. I wish I could have seen it myself before it was published. It was great to look at the skyline that I haven't seen in my entire life. The air quality was really improved when our country was under enhanced community quarantine because transportations were not allowed to use. Let me explain about this statement. The reader had a very simple but straightforward statement about the text, which was, I wish I could have seen it myself before it was published. It is an example of basic assertion. The reader's reaction about the text was happy and amazed. Let's try a few items as practice exercise. Read the text silently. Choose the letter of the best type of assertion in each statement and use emoticons to express your reaction. Let's read a statement about the text. If they didn't fail to secure a tree cutting permit, they will allow to build a cemetery. What type of assertion was used? A. Basic assertion. B. Emphatic assertion. C. Escalating assertion. D. Language Assertion Choose your answer. A, B, C, or D. You got it right! It is letter C. It is Escalating Assertion because the statement was firm. The reader was tough with the statement because the city could have a cemetery if they comply with the law. Let's read the next text silently. Let's read the statement about the next text. We know that everybody feels angry and frustrated while we wait for a response from the government. But the best thing they can do is to give us an estimated time of how long it will take to give solution about air pollution. What type of assertion was used? A. Basic assertion. B. Emphatic assertion. C. Escalating assertion. D. Language assertion. Choose your answer. A, B, C, or D. Did I hear letter B? You are right. It is emphatic assertion because the reader recognized the feeling of other people. In addition, the reader was frustrated about the slow action of the government to the air pollution. Let's 
Let's read the final text silently. Let's read the statement about the final text. It is annoying. Everybody knows about the three great ways to protect our environment, which are reduce, reuse, and recycle. The way we handle waste affects the environment. We must abide for our own safety. What type of assertion was used? A. Basic assertion. B. Emphatic assertion. C. Escalating assertion. D. Language assertion. Choose your answer. A, B, C, or D. The answer is letter D. That's correct. It is language assertion. The reader's feeling was angry. The reader was annoyed for those who don't follow the three R's that can protect the environment. Did you get a perfect score? Did we have the same reaction about the text? That's great! To sum up, always remember that there are four types of assertions with corresponding statements or expressions and reactions. These are the basic assertion, emphatic assertion, escalating assertion, and the last is language assertion. Being aware about the environment is not enough to help preserving it, expressing ourselves about others' negligence, and participating in environmental protection activities will be a huge help for the protection of Mother Nature. Be ready with your paper and pen. You may answer the post test now. Let's reveal the answer for the post test. Wait a minute, you're not yet done. Get to worksheet number 8, English 7, 3rd quarter. Have a nice day.